Yeah. yeah, yeah, someone I look to a lot. Yeah, um, yeah Lomachenko is someone I, I, I look to a lot. A lot of the smaller weights are, are something I look to, me personally, just because I like to kind of, I want to bring that element into heavyweight boxing. I want to be able, I want to be that guy that can, that can move and do things that the lower weight classes are usually kind of on their own in doing, whereas you don't see heavyweights do those things. So that's, that's where I look to him. I look to little things that he does and stuff, and I pick little bits from it that I think could work for me in my game. And yeah, I have a lot of interest in, in Lomachenko. Because mm. I see uh, that, I'm glad you said that because in terms of like bringing certain elements in, because I was watching some of your fights the other day, and I noticed your footwork and the way you were sort of pivoting around the people and it was sort of a very Lomachenko-esque sort of style. Mm. Like the pivot in and the footwork and sort of being in front. And then as they go to throw a shot, you're not there. And I think, yeah. was that sort of subconsciously or not sort of taken from Lomachenko? Or is it just sort of, are you like picking up different traits from everyone at the moment? Yeah, I'm, I'm, still, I'm still in my very early kind of learning yeah. stage. of still figuring out me wholly as a fighter. And, and again, like we were saying before, what works, what doesn't. Picking them bits and throwing away what doesn't work. And I've... I found a good solid base of, of things, of punches, of moves and stuff that work for me. And then from then we're just building and adding different bits and taking bits out. And, and that's where I take that from, is from watching them different fighters. And, and literally, as, as simple as it sounds, just watching them on like TV or YouTube or wherever I'm going, okay, so he does that, he moves there, and that works there. And then I'll go into the gym and I'll try it like on the bag first and I'll see how that feels. And then I'll get my coach to kind of, imitate it and then see how that works and then when I'm at a certain point with it that I feel I'm comfortable enough then I'll take it into sparring and I'll try and use it and then and there's been times where I've tried certain things and it's worked on the bag and then it's worked on the pads and stuff with the coach and I've got into sparring and I've got hit straight in the face and I've gone that doesn't work <laughs> yeah <laughs> that looks good for him over there but that does not work for me in here like so it's fun it's a funny game that you almost have to play with yourself that you build it, you build it, you build it. And then you get to a point where, okay, yeah, that does or that doesn't work. And, and that's just, it's just about being kind of open to new ideas and figuring things out. And that's another thing I love about boxing is that there's so many different ways to do different things. Is that It's just a constant learning curve.